Coco coin, an interesting coin. Uh, what we can say here is, yes, they have actually gone up 3 million in their market cap since our last update. If we are looking at this chart here, what we were expecting was generally to just follow this similar pattern after some deviation on the pump uh, based off the news that they had with BSC, which is essentially a Binance chain supporting them by them winning uh, this this competition, if you see this here, right? Memes, top 10, they won this competition, therefore they got liquidity, which is great to see Binance supporting these guys, and that actually led to a bit of deviation in their price, but back to the normal trend now, and it does seem to be following that trend pretty nicely, and as you can see with this little blip here, yes, uh, this did actually bang it up with a bit of volume and a bit of a price increase from that point as well, so fantastic stuff. Uh, if we are gonna go up, they do have some new news here, which is just about here. Okay, they're actually going to be attending the Binance Blockchain Week, and this is in Dubai, and this will be full of massive, massive players in the blockchain space, all looking to make partnerships, all looking to expand their audiences via those partnerships, B2B, biz to biz, business to business stuff, okay? Uh, and yeah, if these guys are there, they are gonna be looking to make friends with uh, some of these other founders, some of these exchange people, okay? And then from that point, typically you can expect for some news to come out and follow this to pump the coin even more, all right? That's kind of where I'm at with this thing. Uh, obviously, the reason why I hold this thing, as I told you guys, is because of that Binance news, uh, is because when you do see a blockchain in itself, like the Solana Foundation, like the BSC group, right? Uh, any of these kind of big people that are supporting and promoting a chain, right? If they back a coin, then yes, uh, you can expect uh, that coin to have a bit of momentum based on that, right? And it does seem since their airdrop, guys, yes, you get the airdrop dump, the airdrop dumps as normal, of course, but then after that, uh, yes, uh, if the coin starts recovering from that airdrop dump, that's usually a great sign for the coin. So that coupled with the news, coupled with the blockchain week coming up, then yes, uh, this does make sense that this thing will continue to rise. So fantastic stuff there. Uh, if we are gonna go over to the trading view chart here, boom, okay, we can see that uh, yes, we do have this trend line coming through. We have been fighting to try and get over it, okay, but as of right now, we are currently over it. We are testing that 15 minute volume weighted ATR band. Uh, and this is one of the first times actually with this 15 minute volume weighted ATR band that we could potentially be expecting some uh, decent liquidity based trend to come up off of this. Um, obviously, it doesn't always happen. We could come down and test the trend line one more time. Obviously, this trend line is going to be super important. So if we do test it, that's really going to be the test whether this coin is going to kind of succeed or not, in my opinion. Um, if it doesn't kind of hold from this test, then we are going to be looking down at this next level uh, for potentially a bounce. Uh, but uh, down at that level, yeah, this is the key level as well, right? So we'll be watching this intently, but more importantly, with this trend as it is pumping right now, uh, with this this trend if we can do something along the lines of this okay and start getting above these volume weighted ATR bands uh, consistently all right uh, with uh, good fluidity and momentum as well then that's a great healthy sign for this coin and it's something that I would expect to just bang it up to uh, well near the all-time highs to say the least okay so we'll keep an eye on this one but overall that is your update on Coco coin okay typically following the trend they have announced the blockchain week thing here so yes they are pumping right now uh, and yeah essentially the short story is if we get above this kind of area here 1530 that's going to be a very key area for us to potentially bang it from okay so we'll be watching this intently we are making money with this thing okay and what we're doing here is uh is just waiting and just riding that wave as long as we're following this pattern absolutely fine right so that's going to be it from me have a fantastic day let me know in the comments what you think of good old coco coin let me know what you think of Binance chain coins in general do you think there'll be a meme coin wave there um i i personally do okay if i mean binance is massive they are massive they have a lot of power okay the biggest exchange in the world all right so if they are going to back their chain and they want their chain to be adopted by everyone they are going to back the coins on their chain and this is why i think there will be a massive wave on solana as well as ton as well uh, ton will, will have a massive wave soon as well but we'll get to that in another video have a fantastic day cheers